Where do we go from here? That was the question on everyone's mind after COVID-19 forced schools to close last year. At St. Peter's School, we got to work and search for an answer. We formed a science committee to determine the best way forward. Our preparations were intense. We instituted strict protocols, stockpiled supplies, and organized weekly testing for all of our students and staff. Even our HVAC system was ready. And when September came, we welcomed everyone back in person. Things are a little different, but in important ways, they are the same. Our kids are learning, our community is stronger than ever, and we are optimistic about the future. Our teachers, I think, felt incredibly confident in the science committee and the principal's assessment of the safety here. So as a scientist, the most important thing for me was to follow the advice of other scientists and physicians. I feel uh, very uh, confident that the strategy is uh, uh, up and running. I feel like it's setting them up for success this year, but also they're not going to be set back like some kids are with, with distance learning. There's something to be said to have children around other children, to be in a classroom. I think it's easier to con concentrate than online school. Everybody from our staff, our parents, our, our students have really bought in to all these extra measures that we have in place. The communication from the school was excellent. There were lots of emails. When we found out they were doing full in person, I was very excited. So we started the admissions process and it's been great ever since. Our, our community has uh, been vigilant. We test weekly. I like being in person probably because um, you can interact with other kids. You're not staring at a screen all day. It is so much fun to see Miss Hamley again. We are doing all we can to stay safe and healthy. And like everything we do in our small, tightly knit Catholic school, we are doing it together.